Hello and welcome to Weird Ears doing the holiday resort type thing. And you remember the last time we were here, uh, I just got these damn stupid steam boilers up and running. It took all my brains to get it working. You flick the switch now. And. Yep, there they go. All wizard and bang bang. Um, so now. Um, we have got some more work to be done. Um, we, we have the steam power solution. We need to now pipe it into this lot so that it's running off steam power and not these stupid engines that we've got knocking around. Uh, and then we need to work on this jobby over here, which is going to be fed into a steam turbine out here somewhere once we've got the steam produced by a, a second big steam boiler. Um, but we also need uh, an assembly table. I just got to go on the to-do list. This is my to-do list over here. Like so, we need an assembly table so that we can make uh, a control gate for this steam stack, which is going to be powered off a of redstone. I think I'm going to have a pile of redstone energy cells down there. We're going to have one initial one and then a big pile of them and then going to have energy tesseracts coming off that and that's kind of what I've got up here uh, redstone energy storage and tesseracts and then I can change those iron furnaces over there for powered furnaces and um, everything everything be powered off tesseracts I think that's that's the way I'm gonna go um, you'll notice it's a bit quiet uh, Alex isn't here uh, the the, the weird part of weird, in, weird ears is not around at the moment. Uh, we, we have uh, divided to to focus on separate projects. He is, well, we're, we're both hammering the big dig, um, but he's hammering the big dig a lot harder than I am. He's spending a lot of time on the big dig. So, uh, so we don't lose touch of this. I'm going to be spending a lot of time on this, and he'll be he'll be touching base every so often, as I'll be doing in the big dig, just just popping in and, and recording with him, uh, and he'll be around here, keeping an eye on what I'm working on here. Oh, it's just started up again. Excellent. Quarry's going well. Quarry is going well. It's going to be slow, but as soon as we've got a tesseract and a, a big ass red energy storage system we're going to be whizzing through through our quarries in no time uh, so right now um, we need to find a way of temporarily linking this to this um, we can't get rid of we'll use the pickaxe on them get rid of them and then we should be able to take out that and that and over here where we've got two more engines ooh these bad boys are kind of linked down here to this fella there we go and now we're stuck excellent where have we got something we've got wood wood is what we've got we can we can fill this in yeah so alex will be around uh he's not at the moment and the contractor will also be uh, around and about but again right about now isn't uh, he's also very much focused on the big dig, but he he will be around. Um, so we we we're kind of working on multiple projects, multiple mod packs. We, we're also thinking it was something Alex raised as a potential last night, finding a way to link all of our worlds and mod packs through one world, uh, which is going to be messy. Uh, and quite difficult, but not beyond the realms of possibility. I know that goes somewhere, but hmm. I don't think I've got enough parts to do this. If I bring it up here, yeah, like that. And I've got to get to there. And I've got six left. Oh, it's doable. It's easily doable. There we go. Easily doable. There you go. And then we can flick the switch. And these machines should be powered to the mutt's nuts. Did that just surge like you wouldn't believe? Oh, God, it did. That's a lot of power coming out of this thing. I do love these steam engines. They just ram the power into the system the system just doesn't know what's what's going to hit it with all this power in it phenomenal how's our 
Oh, we've still got plenty of fertilizer in there. I haven't dug up much appetite re recently. I don't quite know why we're having an appetite shortage. I need to make this into two iron chests, actually. Because it's... Uh, and I need to find a better place for my crafting table. Because down here it just isn't working. I'm going to move it. I'm going to move this fella now. Come on. Out you come. Out you come. There's a good boy. And we're going to pop him somewhere a lot more usable. Probably in the floor here. There we go. That's better. So we can make two chest upgrades. So we can just expand our storage a bit. I mean, storage, generally not a problem for... for, for for modern mod packs because they've all got applied energistics on but for this mod pack no applied energistics so it's, it is chest storage all the way we just need to work out how we're doing it we clearly have lots of gravel and cobblestone seems how that seems to be just filtering its way straight through I'm not sure what level we're at with that quarry right so over here job one enderman farm uh, now, to do the Enderman farm, we are going to be looking at... We are going to be looking at the soul stuff. So we need a soul forge for starters, and that's obsidian, corrupted essence, and smooth stone. And corrupted essence, would you believe, vile dust and glowstone. And vile dust is uh, cooked soul sand, I think. And I don't think I've got any of that crap here. Oh, but well, what do you know? Soul sand. Uh, more soul sand. Excellent. We'll swap that soul sand for that soul sand, I think. We don't need to cook that much soul sand. We really don't. Uh, what else did we need? Glowstone. We got no glowstone. That means a trip to the nether. I love the nether. You know I love the nether. Ah, I built those chests for a reason, didn't I? So I can offload this junk. Uh, iron. No, it doesn't go in that chest. So, aqueous accumulator, those two, and those two. Ah, oh, it's a shame to be putting them engines down. They were beautiful engines. They really were. Uh, iron can go back in there. And we will cook off. Let's just, let's just check what vile dust actually is. Yeah, it is just cooked soul sand. So, we will lash in our furnace, which I think is this fella. Half of that. There you go. You can you can chew on that. And the rest of that can go back in one of these chests. Ooh, we've got five obsidian there. Did you see that? We've got five obsidian. That's enough to make. We just need the glowstone. So, nether time. Into the nether. To get some glowstone dust. Such that we can make the, the thing that is going to make everything work for us. I love my volcano layer now it, it just looks awesome and it's got that massive power system in there that's just going to be binging and a bonging and a banging I'm hoping the pigmen aren't angry i can't remember i know we parted kind of earlier on on unhappy terms but i think we're we were all we're all cool now they've forgiven me i think there might be some glowstone up here or it could be fire We'll go up there and have a look, see, see what we can, see what we can snaffle from the the the, the grumpy pigmen paradise. Ooh, diamond pickaxe is uh kind of making a pretty old mess of this. Ah, glowstone, that's what we're after. That would be the thing. What we would be thinking about getting and stuff. It's a way to trash your pickaxe. And how. Any more around? Oh, I think there might be some over there too. Cool. Did not... Mind you, these, these, these waypoints in this map system are not terribly reliable. It uh, has to be said. has to be said. I apologise for saying it, but it does have to be said. The waypoints in this, this mapping system show up in all the wrong places. Actually, I haven't got any waypoints. I don't know why I've got no waypoints. It's going to make life difficult because I've got to get back to the quarry. Yoink. And the quarry was purely accessed via waypoints. 
How did I get up here? Here. That's where I came up. I heard one of those crybaby booful things then. Yeah, that's that's not that's not good glowstone to get at. It's not ideal. How much did we get? Oh, we got over a stack. That'll do for starters. There's some more here. Yeah, we got we got some. We don't need oodles to start with. We just need a bit to get going, and that's that's going to be the bit that we need to get going. Uh, yeah, the 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 the. Where was I going? I was I was I was on about something. I was having a rant about something. Holy crap! What was that? Where did you come from? Sweet jumping Jehoshaphat. Yeah, you can't get me now, can you, you floaty bag of crap? Jesus, that scared the bejesus out of me, the way you just wallop. There you go, have that. Stitch that. My god, that was not fun. I did not enjoy that experience at all. So, we've got our glowstone dust, and hopefully now we've also got the ability to turn that... No, not with that tool, that one. There we go. Turn that off, because these have done their jobs. Uh, there's our vile dust. Excellent. Yeah, they're all... They're all they've are all done all the jobs that they needed to do. Ooh. Got a, bit of, got a bit of spitting out going on. You can have that back, mate. Um, we've got this lot which can go into the processing facility. Always good to keep on top of your ores. That will clear shortly. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. This is just me sitting and waiting now. You are watching while I'm waiting. It's quite exciting stuff. Come on, shoot. There we go. Uh, and that should be powering down, I don't know. I think there may be a bit of stored energy in these. Yeah. They got they got a lot of power going. There is a lot of power coming out of that system now. It is absolutely binging and a banging and a banging. Technically speaking. There we go. 36 corrupted essence. And so we need the obsidian. Do we get any smooth stone? Yes, we do. We need three of them. We need the five obsidian. And we need the crafting table. One, two, three, four, five. Obsidian. One corrupted essence. And that gets us a soul forge. Excellent. And where are we going to put our soul forge? Hmm. Choices, choices, choices. We might stick it here, actually. It's not going to upset our our thingamajiggy, but it's it's good. Oh, that's nice. So now we need some diamonds. Shine bright. Like it. We got two diamonds. We've not had much luck with diamonds on this. But we have had log luck with wood. So uh, we can actually make. There we go. More, more, more diamonds from wood. Because we've got. I, I think we've got equivalent exchange three on this. Uh, it's going to be the. Yeah, because we've got minium stones. We've got mini shards of minium. I've seen shards of minium. So I know that uh, we've, we've got the, the correct mod pack on. There we go. Sorted. While we're at it, we better make some liquid redstone all up in its whatever it's got that it needs redstone in. So we'll just chuck that in the magma crucible. That will mulch it down and feed it into our liquid transposer. Ready for when we've got our energy frames, which we haven't got yet. Oh, no. Get off the floor. You have no place being on the floor. Get back in the chest. Uh, we got more of this netherrack crap. Where's the netherrack crap chest? That's the netherrack crap chest. And basalt cobblestone. That might as well go in there too. Hmm. I could do with the silk touch on my pickaxe, but I haven't got it. Uh, so. We're cooking over here. Our, our soul forge is, 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 is banging away. So we need to think about a second storage tank. Hmm. Where are we going to have a... I think it's got to be in the wall here. 
obviously where I've uh, how many of it have five obviously where I've got my signs is where I want to now put my I have to move that sign to be over here somewhere uh, there we go tesseracts done this this doesn't go anywhere anymore it goes into the back of uh, the contractor's swimming pool but th obviously that serves no practical purpose that stuff doesn't do anything at the moment so I think we need to build our tank here does that look about right five yep five and it needs to be five deep as well uh, four high one two three four yep that's right and this tank will hold our biofuel. Uh, let me quickly just check what these engines are doing. They're kind of holding their own. Everything, everything is just whizzing like you wouldn't believe. It's great. I love it. The system works so well. Now, I don't know how deep this mountain actually goes. I'm going to take out those three, like so, and I'm guessing it's five back again as well, because these are flush with the surface, so that's three, four, I'm guessing the ground went up naturally here, five, there we go, that's the depth we need to go back to, cool, let's get rid of this dirt. No, we don't need to go that far back. Don't get carried away. If you don't need to dig it, don't dig it. Digging just causes lag, as the world has to render more surfaces and, and bits and bobs and stuff, and, and then the game gets angry with you, and, and, and there's recrimination and all that sort of stuff. So we're just we're just going to crack on and get a tank in here. We've got to go down one layer as well so that it sits flush on the floor like that one does over there that's that's the aspirant thinking that we are currently aspirant thinking about now where these are our two say a biofuel that's what we need so these are our two biofuel jobby jobby job jobs and I guess if we take out of the center uh, and then just take it over there would that work don't know don't know, don't know, actually don't know who I'm asking but that's what we'll try and do uh, so we'll just bin our basaltic cobblestone again and have we got tank parts none there uh, we got Tank gauge, we've got one of them. Multi tanks, iron plates. And iron plates is what you need to make your tanky bits. Ooh, what was in there? No, nothing. Excellent. Excellent, we've got nothing. Uh, we're, we're cooking iron, aren't we? I remember that. We've got iron cooking in here. So we'll make some more plates in here. Like so. I'm pretty sure it's plates we need. Let's have a look. Tank. Tank wall, yeah, four plates. Yep. That's okay. That's cool. Uh and do we do we auto craft them or do we do we uh Yeah, it's just shape crafting. That's fine. I'm happy enough with just shaped crafting. Okay, thirty two of them. That's good. So we, we kind of want wall on all sides apart from the front, which is going to be, uh, we're just going to have gauge in. Where are we going to bring this fluid in? Probably in the bottom somewhere. Yeah, we'll bring it in on the bottom somewhere. We could actually... Mm, yeah, we'll bring it in, in the center in the bottom, I think. That's my plan. That's plan number one. And we've run out of... Uh, well, that can go there. Because that's, that's just where it's going to live, you see. 
um, 